questions of Varas, but can't get the opening goal. This one is in for the opening goal. Sergio Ramos reels off to celebrate as Real Madrid take the lead around about halfway through. Real Madrid grabbed their third consecutive win in the Liga BBVA after defeating Las Palmas 2-1. Zidane's men didn't shine at the Gran Canaria Stadium, but took the three points thanks to two set pieces. Swung over by Jesse, and it's not an in. I'm very happy with the result, and I'm a little bit worried about the second part, yes. I'm happy with the result, but I'm a little bit worried with our second half performance. The important thing is that we came away with the three points, but we have to analyse the game from tomorrow onwards because I'm a bit concerned about that second half. The Blancos now face Sevilla, one of the four teams who have beaten them in the league this season. But there's a very important factor, the Santiago Bernabeu. Real Madrid are almost unstoppable at home, and the Andalusians are recognisable on the road. The confidence I have in the players has to be aimed at having players prepared for when things like this happen. The players who didn't play today are training now, precisely for that, to be prepared for the next game. That's important, the attitude of the squad is good, and that helps us perform well. Has he got enough to get past Victor? He has. It's Kevin Gamero! And that's the first goal for Sevilla! Unai Emery's men want to win their first away game in the league this season, and are confident after defeating Villarreal a win that leaves them five points off the Champions League. Should be three, four for Sevilla. The Andalusians have a number of players missing with Banega out suspended and Nzonzi, Konoplyanka and Bitolo all out injured. But Krichoviak could return. On his behalf, Zinedine Zidane must rebuild his defence as Sergio Ramos and Pepe are out suspended. Nacho Fernandez and Rafael Baran will form an unusual pairing in the heart of defence.